in this video we plot the graph square root ax plus b modulus of ax plus b and c plus minus absolute value of ax plus b after that we draw the graph of modulus of x upon x sine 1 upon x and x sine 1 upon x e to the power x and e to the power minus x obviously for these three graphs your x is non-zero and in next we draw e to the power ax plus b log ax plus b 1 upon ax plus b sin ax plus b cos ax plus b modulus of sin ax plus b and modulus of cos ax plus b so uh, now we start sage terminal on sage cell server first uh, uh, we draw the graph plot in parenthesis we write x and press evaluate button on the sage server you get the equation of a straight line passing through origin and inclined and angle 45 degree now in our first video we plot the graph of a star x okay and in that video uh, we uh, plot this graph for only positive value of a now in this video we plot uh, the graph of the function a star x for negative values also for a in range minus 10 to 2 ok so and we take x mean is equal to minus 5 and x max is equal to x max is equal to plus 5 okay then we press evaluate button on sage math cell and if you use desktop version of sage math cell then you press enter then look at this this gives you the graph of of the function uh, a star x okay this line this line is for positive value of a the straight line uh, means x axis is for a is equal to 0 and all these straight lines for uh, negative value of a okay now we come on to the plotting of graph of first we plot square root of x plot write p l o t in parenthesis you write s q r t for a square root you write s q r t and in the parenthesis you again write x if you write plot square root x s q r t x then press evaluate button on sage math cell server and for desktop version you press enter then look at this again you get the graph of square root of x now uh, we uh, draw the square root of x and you know in the sage math cell the default picture a uh, default figure uh, is uh, given for minus 1 to plus 1 and you know the square root function is defined only for positive value of x means non negative values of x ok so we take x min is equal to uh, we suppose uh, uh, 0 and x 
max is equal to take 10 10 20 30 any value of there is no restriction on that so for in this case we press enter we get the graph of the function okay now we plot our function plot the a uh, first we write s q r t in parenthesis we write a star x for a in range in range what range 1 to 5 okay and x min is equal to x min is equal to 0 and uh, your x max is equal to x max is equal to 10 and then press enter on desktop version and if you uh, plot the graph online using sage math cell server then you press evaluate button look at this these are this is the graph of a star x now we are trying to draw the graph of square root of ax plus b so we write plot sqrt ax plus b for a uh, uh, for b in range uh, we take uh, 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 0 to 5 okay and a in range 1 to 5 and look at the graph okay you look at this this graphs contains 1 2 3 4 5 3 to 5 3 to 5 3 to 5 means there are uh, four bunches and each bunch contains five graphs and if x is if b is equal to 0 then the graph is started from 0 to okay and so on now we come on to the graph of modulus of ax plus b means absolute value of ax plus b so before starting is absolute value of ax plus b we first plot absolute value of x if you write absolute value of x and then press enter you get the graph of this this graph passes through origin and this shape of the graph is v shape graph okay now next and uh, uh, look at uh, one more point uh, in this uh, graph uh, this graph, uh, the default value shown in the x-axis is minus 1 to plus 1. Now, uh, we define uh, the minimum and maximum value, uh, minimum and maximum value, x min is equal to minus 5 and x max is equal to 5 and this then press enter our evaluate button on sage math cell look at this graph okay so now we come on to the first we plot the graph of absolute value of ax so plot absolute value absolute abs a star x okay for a in range uh, right uh, minus uh, 3 comma uh, 2 okay you take any value 
any value you give a so here we give him the value minus 3 to 2 okay and rest of the conditions are same means x minimum minus 5 x max plus 5 you ten you take x minimum minus 10 and x max uh, 5 any value you take in negative x axis and positive x axis then the graph is so now press evaluate button on uh, sage math cell server or press uh, enter button on desktop version look at this this is the graph okay and you see the value of only value on y axis is started is 5 10 15 20 25 and so on so this is the graph of your Mm, is absolute value of ax now we come on to the graph of ax plus b okay you may define for a in range minus 3 to 2 or for b in range minus 1 comma 1 means you may define either uh, first b after a okay and vice versa so now we press evaluate button on sage math cell server or press enter button on desktop version you look at this this is the graph of the function you look this graph is starting from the value of x axis and our value from y axis okay this is the graph of your mm. is absolute value of ax plus b now we come on to the graph of absolute value c plus minus absolute value of ax plus b so we write c plus absolute value of uh, ax plus b uh, for c in range we write uh, uh, the range is uh, minus 2 to 2 okay then press enter or evaluate button on sage math cell server there is a 40 graphs look at this this is the graph of is uh, absolute value of c plus c plus absolute value of ax plus b okay now uh, we going to plot the function c minus absolute value of ax plus b so we plot this look at this 